Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda. We're gonna get right back into finishing this game here. Uh, I know in the in the last uh, in the last movie, I was going on and on and on and on about uh, getting the bombs there in level eight and whatnot. Yeah, apparently it's been so damn long since I played the game that I forgot that they were in level seven. I'm sure, anybody who's been watching it. No, knew anything about it. We're like, ah, they're at seven, you jackass, and blah blah blah. Yeah, I now realize the error of my ways, and definitely made myself look dumb there. So we're not even gonna bother going to pick them up at this point because we're at the end of the game. It's just four more bombs. Um, the only other thing we're not gonna do is uh, we're not gonna worry about getting the red ring. Um. It really only downs the damage you take by another half heart, so it's it's not really all that useful. Um, also, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, even though I said I was going to try to go through this whole game without using it, I'm going to pick up some medicine just in case I decide to start, you know, playing bad and get roth stomped and whatnot. So, just for safety's sake, I am going to acquire some of this NyQuil over here. Big and small, why big? You know, I, I like how the shopkeepers just freaking disappear as soon as you buy something from them. It's like, hey, you bought my stuff? <laughs> Ripped off! See ya! All right, let's do it. Yoink! I think, if I remember right, you have to go with this way. Yes. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna just warn you now. I am not gonna remember. Well, I am not 100% certain. I am gonna remember the way to go whole way through. And the magic wand really lights that guy up. <laughs> Get it? It's because it's fire? Never mind. Like, like, see? Love doing that. Hitting him with a sword and then the beam afterward because you hit him back so far. just for the hell of it. Now, speaking of this guy here, if you have a 3DS and you haven't already, go on to the, the, the shop, download yourself a free copy of uh, the 25th uh, anniversary edition of uh, the Four Sword Adventures. It is a completely, completely new adventure can be played, you know, one to four players. Go to the next room. That's fairly obvious. But, uh, and that little dude that I fought there in that room down there, uh, the, the boss fight against Vadi has a little throwback to that there, so. Just something I'd, uh, I think that all of you, uh, Zelda fans would enjoy very much. I did enjoy it myself. I've just about finished, but I can't figure out how to get the third door in Vadi's temple open. So, that's that. But definitely go pick up a copy of that 25th anniversary of uh, Four Swords. Alright, you go left. Yes, left. Run right through the middle of the bats. Killing a few on the way. I just love the effect of these guys. They make it look like they're going right. Oh, I finally got hit. And got hit again. And again. And you'll drop a fairy. Or not. Alright, short detour here. Go pick up the, uh. 
silver arrows, because you sort of need them to plant into Ganondorf's ass. Or Ganon's ass, I'm sorry, he's not. Oh, wait a minute. I can't remember if it's Ganondorf in the first one. Uh, I don't know. But anyway. Uh oh. Get in the middle here. Being on the outside there is bad news. Bad news, bears! Alright, then we have ourselves some silver arrows. Well, now we have some silver arrows. <laughs> Alright, well, let's make our way to Ganon. Dwarf. I don't remember. Whoa! I forgot to kill these guys. Ow. No hearts! Man, where's the love? Okay, you go up from here. Oh yeah. Little uh, tip from me: Do not ever go up from here, unless you want like 15 minutes of unnecessary dungeon. But then be my guest, go up. But you will end up going all the way back around, and you will get nothing for it but a face beating. Go left. That is the way you need to go. Hearts! Hearts! Oh yeah, yeah. <clears throat> oh, I'll definitely kill the wizard ropes in this room. There we go. They're nice and easy because this is all that they do. Like seriously. Okay. Perhaps I was wrong. But you get what I'm saying. All they do is just teleport themselves over that blood water. Back. Nope. Ha ha! Bombed you. Alright. One more room. And then we are, uh... We are ready to kill that old pig boy. going to up that medicine just in case. But I don't think that we'll need it. Not the cheese it! Damn. There's one. There's two. Wow. Jeez. Oh, get us over arrow. No! Ah! What now? And we did not need the medicine. Ha ha! Kicking in the sand, kicking in the sand. Ha! What now? What's up, baby? Ha 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 ha. You like it, sword, don't you? Oh, well, that'll do it! That was The Legend of Zelda quest number one. Thanks, Link. You're the hero of Hyrule. Jesus! 
finally, peace returns to Hyrule. This ends the story. So, yeah, I pretty much accomplished everything that we uh, set out to accomplish. We have everything except for the red ring and that second set of bombs, but uh, I don't really consider the bombs part of... Com well, I guess they are, but... Uh, we did get all the way through the game without having to use potion, so... Uh, I guess that's a, a bit of a quest there. But uh, yeah, 25 years of The Legend of Zelda now. 1986. Still playing the game even today. It's freaking crazy. It's still fun to play. But, uh... Um... If I get any requests for it, I mean, I sincerely doubt it, I'm going to give the second quest a try. But I know it will not be anywhere near as short as these movies were. Because I pretty much know everything of the first quest, but, uh... Alright, guys, uh, that was, that was it. That was The Legend of Zelda, so... Thanks for uh, watching, and I will see you guys at the next Let's Play video.